Dr. Klaus, uh, phenomenal. Great coach, a great leader for our team, great mentor, a great friend is what he's turned out to be. At uh, both the competitions in Texas, we're obviously stressed and we wanted some sort of relief, so we like to go out to get a nice dinner, a nice steak, of course, and Dr. Klaus was kind of like our, our father and told us to be back at a, a certain time and not to go out, not to have too much fun. Well, on two occasions, two trips to Texas, we let him down. We decided to stay out longer, longer than we were supposed to. And when we got back, it was, it was the, we were the bad children. We were looking down, we were, we knew he was upset. He was very mad at us. He, he knew that we were so close to winning both of these that we should stay focused, we should stay practicing. Uh, and we shouldn't let that slip up by our affinity towards food and, and going out. Um, he was supportive to us throughout all businessman competitions, whether we did well after a round or poorly. He kind of knew the right thing to say. He learned how to the, understand the chemistry of our team, the buttons that he needed to push in order to uh, motivate certain people, because obviously between the five of us, we're all motivated a little bit differently. Um, but uh, many times he was the reason I think that we got up and got excited and were able to take something that may have been um, a disappointment after an initial round and turn it into a positive and make it a, a strength of ours in the next round. When we won Venture Labs, which was our second winning as the, the global uh, right goes, I think I was more excited for Dr. Klaus than us because he had spent, I think his wife said, 25 years trying to get to this, this level. And he worked so hard with us. He was up at midnight with us in our hotel rooms, trying to perfect every little thing. And to know that it was just what he wanted and what he had worked so hard for, that was my first thought after winning. 